So yeah, I haven't really seen anything about this. So, fuck it. I guess we'll just see as we go. <clears throat> I only saw the Game Awards trailer and like the initial like teasers. That's it. Our destination is Port Brylehaven, the capital of the Western Principality of Oceania. Okay, I'm gonna need captions. I didn't understand a single word you said. Take its head as proof, then get it to the goal line before the deadline. Okay. The head, the better. If it's not so is it still on the calendar system? Won't look twice at you. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. I like the character designs. That's I mean, but that's like I like the character designs, but that's just you Narukami with horns. And this is just a, a I guess Makoto fusion. From the creators of Persona Three. Whoa, 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 hold on. Okay, okay. I, I'm not gonna lie. I only saw Persona Five, so I, you know, I was, I was about to pull off the dick riding, but I right, better show all three of them. How long is the journey to Brylehaven? Four days. Not to brag, but Four days. This What's the story of this, though? Well, I don't. I mean, I guess I wouldn't really want to know. Uh huh. Where to? Plan and enjoy your journey. Finally, some fun. Okay, wait. I did see it. There's still like time, right? Days until yeah okay so they're still like you're still like limited on time. Here we go. Finally some fun. Just jump off. Oh yeah the roof yeah the rope on him right. I want to see how the combat looks. Cause I heard that like it's different. Also I am not eating that shit. I'll eat anything but I'm not eating that shit. Let's get this plan underway. Who are y'all fetching? Also are these the only party members? Stop Who are you? Besides, okay, this. Okay, it's still turn based. It's about whoever can bring in the biggest monster. Wait. Right? If you imbeciles can okay, that might be another party member. No chance of winning. This is what I wanted to see. This is what I want to see. Dive in an exhilarating turn based and real time action combat system. What does that mean? That straight, you... So you can just like straight up fight like this? How do you fight? I'm looking at the buttons on the bottom. Skills? No chance of winning. You would what a squad mean? As reliable warriors, Does that like turn we it into like turn base? Obstacles. I'm confused on that part. Believe in the strength oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Overcome plenty of obstacles. Let's no, go back. Want to see their names? Reliable warriors, correct? We've overcome plenty of obstacles. Okay, here we go. Okay, choose who's gear. Okay, pro tag. Okay, they don't have a name yet. I wonder if. I feel like we're gonna be naming them, right? Are they another silent pro tag? I don't know if I want a silent pro tag. I don't know. Okay, then we have Stroll. He's a oh wait. oh they're they're a trickster. The pro tag is a trickster. Okay, it's not. It's not. <laughs> Alice, I see what you're doing. <clears throat> okay, Stroll is the swords master. More like you, Norikami. But I, I'm 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 you, Norikami's biggest dick rider. So you don't have to you don't have to do that to me. Wait, ranks. What are these? Rank 4 out of 20? Rank 10 out of 20? Okay, so that's not levels, it's ranks. And you max out at 20 instead. Okay, that's different. That's different. <clears throat> Hulkenberg. That's a little bit of a mouthful. I can just call you Hulk. Heismay. Okay, I can just call you May. Juno. Cool. Galaga. Okay. Okay. Job, si job system? What the f- Oh! Oh! oh. Oh, oh, I guess. Wait, no, I don't know what you mean. I'm not gonna lie. I was about to just, I was about to cap my ass off. I have no clue what you mean by job system. Weaker enemies go down in real time, maybe? That would be cool. <clears throat> and um, she's the navigator, right? Wait, but... Oh, never mind. Okay, so you can only have four, four party members. Because uh, that's why I was wondering why Juno wasn't in a thing, but yeah. Never mind. Archetype details. Let's believe... Oh. See, you're going, you're going too fast. You're going too fast. You're going too fast. We've overcome plenty of obstacles. I'm breaking it down. I'm breaking it down. Okay, here we go. Let's... Okay, they get a weapon, armor, gear, and accessory. Archetype. Strong. Okay, this is just like the, the gear system. The the okay. Bullet barrage. God damn, I'm pausing a lot. My bad, my bad. And this is only the first trailer. Oh, shit. <clears throat> okay, it's MP. Is it MP in Persona? I don't remember. Is it MP or SP in Persona games? Did I already forget? What is it in Persona games? Is it SP or MP? It's SP, right? <clears throat> Shall I is like a selectable? It's like selectable classes with each one having certain abilities. When you rank them high enough, you keep some of the abilities. 
Oh, okay, 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 okay. Even when you change the character's job, I don't think you'll be able to change the character's job, you know? <clears throat> or maybe you could. I don't know, man. Okay, there's fire and light. What is this? Okay, good. There's animated cutscenes. I need that. Need that. Almost feels like everything we thought we knew about the world was wrong. Damn. I feel like I saw it. You can fish from inside? That's cool. Oh, there's pets. Who are you? Who's that? Deepen as you soar to new heights. And those are they, oh damn, you know she got the fattest forehead of all time. As you Look at this. To new I just I mean her too. God <laughs> damn. Look at how long her bangs are. Her forehead come up here. And hers, oh my god. You just know you just know they got the dome skis. And those are Zombs. I feel quite quite uh, right? Right? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I was lost. For a long time that if I wanted to feel accepted, what is this? I'd what is this theme in the back? Power, status. It's an Atlas game, so I'm expecting yes, banging music. Allies, friends. You're already one of us. I'm not really into like fantasy type games, but both got something we'd fight it's an Atlas game. I'm gonna play it. And I'm interested in this, which is a good thing. Venture forth. Thy journey shall reveal thy soul's mission. Take some detours and discover this new world. Okay. Travel beyond fantasy into your reality. Okay, so I'm expecting you to be able to like freely be able to do a lot of things. <clears throat> Shigenori Soejima. Okay, Shoji Mag Oh shit, he left Persona to do this shit? Oh man, that means that means that means the game is gonna be pretty pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. When is it? That's right, it does have the same release date as Dragon Ball. I mean Sparking Zero has the early access, so I'm gonna be on Sparking Zero for those first three days, but I I'm gonna I'm gonna still stream this when it comes out. Uh This is the digital deluxe? How do I, wait, if this is digital. Oh, these are digital art books, digital soundtrack. Oh, but a costume and battle. I don't care about the digital soundtracks and art books. I can find all that shit online. But costume and battle BGM set? That's, oh, oh wait, it's over here, it's over, all right. We got the seven, we got, we got, wait, is, right? Seven Sisters, that's the first one? Or is that the second one? What school is Persona 1? Is, is Persona 1 Seven Sisters? Or is that Persona 2? What school is Persona 1? I feel like Seven Sisters is Persona 2. St. Ermelin, St. Saint, Hermelin, Saint that's Persona 1. And Seven Sisters is Persona 2. Gecko Con. Yeah, you know, that's, this, 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 my, this my shit, man. It's my shit. It's that big Yasuo got me, bro. Uh, Shujin. I don't know what this is from. I want to say this is SMT5, right? They have the flowers on their uniform, and I have no clue what this is. Atlas dropping this at the same time as Sparking Zero is like Kanye versus 50 Cent. <laughs> Which, I'm not going to lie, I kind of feel bad for Atlas, because, listen, it's, it's going to be a good game, but, like, you're up against a juggernaut, you know? Like, ugh. I don't think that's a good idea. Also, is that Catherine I see? <clears throat> Why do they brand Catherine with... I guess she is the Sea Catherine, right? And the name of the game is Sea Catherine. <clears throat> but no, Catherine is such an underrated game. Alright. Also, hold on. Can we stop with the glaze, bro? Like, I get it. Joker is popular, but damn, man. Not Hobino. I... Dick Ryan. Also, why is Joker and Morgana there? They only need one rep. I'm not going. I love Persona Five is my second favorite Persona game. Okay, I, I sound like a crazy hater right now, but can you smell it? Whatever. There's change in the air. I want to protect this? this country and its people. You dreamt of utopia. Hey, okay, this is like more cutscenes and shit. Oh, the kids. The one who 
They look a little funky. They have the stuff. So they're not human. I feel like that's obvious by now. They have ram horns and shit. They can't be human. Wait. Juggernaut for... Tournament? Tournament? Listen, when uh, when I hear tournament, I go flung. <laughs> tournament for the throne? Nonetheless, I can take the throne. Tell me, I can take the throne. <clears throat> the leader within you? Oh damn! Needs a wake up call. Oh, I need to be humbled. I'm too strong for my own. <laughs> what the fuck did he transform into? With your own campaign poster and campaign to claim the throne and win prizes. Wait, is that is that what the is that what the game is about? If that's the case, this is elite. Campaign. Awaken your power. Okay, so I make my own campaign poster in game. And campaign to claim the throne and win prizes. Whoa, 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 no, no, hold on, hold on. Is that what it actually is? Or is this like some stupid ass fucking promotion? Campaign posters? I don't know what the game is about, man. It might. Bro, if that's a promotion, that's fucking weak. 19 minutes? I'm not gonna lie, I don't care. Uh, destination okay. is Port Brylehaven, the capital of the Western Principality. Sorry, I, I, sorry, I have a, uh, I have brain rot. Our first trial is to slay a monster. We take its head as proof and get it to the goal line before the deadline. Okay, we already heard this. We already heard this. We saw twice you. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. We already saw this shit, didn't we? How long is the journey to Brylehaven? Four days. Not to brag. Bring in the biggest monster, right? If you saw this already. I mean. Okay, but the, they, they're all here. Here we go. We're, they're gonna talk about shit. They're gonna talk about shit. When I was asked, they had a booth for something like this with those banners you could have. Your oh, that's damn. I hope that's an indie game. Hello, everyone. I'm Katsuro Hashino, the director of Metaphor. Oh, wait, wait, wait. They have their own. They have their own. Katsuro. My representative works include Shin Megami Tensei three, Persona four, five, three, okay. four, and five. In previous nice, shows, nice, nice. The general flow of the game, as well as the combat and story elements. In this Atlas exclusive showcase world tour, uh -huh. show, we will be going over the journey aspects. A wonderful <laughs> journey aspects. aspects. Okay. The journey gameplay is what uniquely sets this game apart from the Persona and Shin Megami Tensei series. Mm -hmm. I'm extremely excited to share the details. With not you. much a journey in those other games. You know, you stay in one. Well, not an SMT that. Five so far. There's been a journey. I haven't played SMT three, and but Persona's three, four, and five. You stay in one location. For pretty much. Showcase, world tour edition. I'll be sharing brand new, never before seen content for RPG fans, as well as those who are first learning about metaphor through this showcase. Okay. Yep. I hope you see the fun adventure you can experience through this. Come game. on, I need something good. I need something good. Make sure to subscribe. Shut the fuck up. Start of the journey. First, let us start by reviewing the beginning of the game. Okay. The story is set in the United Kingdom of Ukronia. United Kingdom of Ukronia. Okay, Ukronia. Big U. With his very companion, I gotta rep that set. Galica. Whoa, whoa, whoa. First, let us start by reviewing the beginning of the game. The story is set in the United Kingdom of Ukraine. Uh huh. The protagonist. Is protagonist is on a mission with his fairy companion. Oh, okay, so she's the she's the Morgana of the game. She's the. It's on a mission I like with that. I, I fuck with Morgana. I know a lot of people don't like Morgana, but I like Morgana. Companion, to save his friend, the prince from a curse. What? To save his friend, the prince from a curse. Okay. During his journey, he awakens an archetype. The secret. He awakens an archetype. Okay, so you awaken to an archetype, the secret. Oh, that's what he transformed into. Reminds me of Izanagi no Kami. He's just, which is, you know, doing good things to me. In order to save the prince, he has to the defeat the prince of the castle. Okay, my bad. Uh, uh, all right. This is too fast for me. And not only did they curse the prince, the culprit also, also assassinated, assassinated. Oh, okay, so that's why there was a the thing for the throne. For the, the throne. Capital to take him down. Okay. However, upon the king's death, the, the king, king evoked form. royal magic, which began <clears throat> the royal tournament. The royal tournament? Where the people's faith is the key to select the next king. Okay. As a result, the entire kingdom is thrown into chaos. In all the turmoil, the protagonist makes the decision, the decision? to participate in the royal tournament. Let's fucking go! Let's go! Yes! Yes! Tournament. I love yo tournament arcs is peak anything. You give me anything with a tournament arc, I promise you that's my favorite fucking arc. Yes, I'm already. Yeah, uh, you're I'm, you're sold. I'm sold. I've been sold now. Tournament. That's all. That, that's all you need to say. The culprit, Louise. Fuck the culprit. I want to be king. This is how they begin their battle, a journey that takes them all across the kingdom. 
traveling on a mechanical carriage called the Gauntlet, the Gauntlet Runner. Runner. Okay. Okay, what's next? What's next? This is a town out in the countryside that the party okay. visits in the beginning of the story. <clears throat> right, right, right. What well, are we doing out here? The game to incrementally increase freedoms for the player. Uh huh. Obtaining a Gauntlet Runner after the story prologue increases the player's ability to travel around. Okay, okay. <laughs> Let's explore the town. Well, what are we doing this time? Do you have some courage? Oh, so social stats are back in this too. Okay. Are there any social links, perhaps? Destination are activities unique to that you area. Know? Any confidants? In this town, there's a test of courage where you bungee jump up a cliff. Wait, but do you actually participate in you the thing, or is it just a like cutscene? Milk cows. Milk cows? Through the tolerance increased. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. What is up with this bougie ass cow? <laughs> Why does cow look like it's playing dress to impress? <laughs> These activities, you can increase your virtues as a traveler. That's crazy. Increasing these virtues okay. enables you to take off. God damn, how many are there? Oh, there's only five. I, I don't know. There was too many things pointing at each other, okay? It felt like there was more than that, but it's only five. Okay. Okay, so there's to there's courage, wisdom, tolerance, imagination. What's this one? Oh, new Tongue tied? I can't really see. Is that like maybe elusiveness? That It has something to do with speech. Eloquency? Uh, flu fluency, maybe? <clears throat> fluency, right? Wonder how that works. There is a calendar system. Like you have like a de you have deadlines. Quests. I think that might be fluency. It's up. Right. It's up to you, the player, on how you want to spend every single day of your journey before encountering your main quest. Okay. Leading up to your main quests, you can strengthen your forces by completing side quests. Okay, there's gonna be hella side quests. Increase your bonds with your followers, or do activities that increase the protagonist's virtues. As long as they're interesting side quests, I'm down. To choose what you want to do each day, much like uh -huh. real life. That's fire. I like that. Can I sleep in though? If you want okay. to improve your fighting abilities. You can visit the recruitment center to accept on a Oh shit, hold up, hold up, hold up. To improve your How do you do that? <gasps> How'd you do that? How did you do that? I don't see anything on the bottom right that gives you an option to do whatever that it just is. I'm assuming skills is gonna bring up a skill menu, but you can visit they the just straight up did that. Recruitment center to accept side requests <clears throat> called side bounties request? to exterminate Okay, that's how you monsters. get money? We took on a request to okay. exterminate a monster called Valmo. Valmo. You get information on its whereabouts, but there's no need to head out immediately if you're not prepared for the fight. Okay. This person standing outside looks like he has a request for us. We've been asked to buy something from a nearby town. From a, oh, so you could travel to different towns like while there's you're. There's a stop on the way to the labyrinth where the Valmo is for the okay. extermination request we took on. There's a lot of people in town. Okay, so there's a lot you can do. You there's could probably like. To you. you could probably um. What's the word I'm looking for? Blank, help me out. What's the word I'm looking for? Uh, fuck, I don't know. What, I don't know what I'm looking for. Damn, what's the word? Fuck. Um. Mo nah, not not multitask. Like, you know, get like prep for everything to be the best. Damn. Ah, oh, damn. What's the word? What's the word? What's the word? It's on the tip of my tongue, man. I almost said it. I almost thought it like twice. Uh, uh, I'm stuck on this. I'm stuck on this. Somebody, come on. Just start throwing words at me. Uh, uh, uh. Not pre it's not prep. It's not. No, it's not anticipate. Pre no, it's not pre-frame. It's like, you know. <sighs> Bro, like the best way to like. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm not gonna think of the word. I'm, I'm stupid. About the main quest, but in this town you can. Well, basically, what I'm trying to say is you, you know, you can like schedule your like what you you can stack up. Optimize. Thank you, Blank. Thank you. Yes, optimize. I knew you had me. Yes, optimize. 
like the best you know like you know the best things to do on each specific day like you can do mad shit in one day rather than being stupid and you know not meeting a deadline because you still have to do something else ask about the town special like you really got to optimize your time properly yes among these people the yeah optimize the path of time yeah that's what i was looking for for getting intel they're Intel. useful resources, as you can learn more about rumors as well as the no, habits. No, please don't bring back the rumor system, bro. I did not like that part of about Persona 2. I did not like the whole rumor shit. That the was so whack to me. Come across. But the information costs money. If you're like, if it's, like, optional, like, it just, like, helps you, like, you know, like, with a person, like, with a monster's weaknesses. Like, okay, that's cool. But, like, no, it's not, like, don't make it, like... Like, I guess don't enforce it. Like, don't make it needed. Isn't that essentially multitasking? No. Optimization isn't multitasking. It could, like, it could be, but not in this instance. I don't think so. Because multitasking is doing two things at once. Uh, optimizing is, like, planning a route that lets you do more, like, in one day, rather than spreading it out across multiple days, is what I'm trying to say. Never play Persona 2 and never will? Would you play, will you play it when it gets remastered? your fighting abilities you could choose to tackle enemies without buying the information before okay okay this, okay that's perfect then yeah see here's some beautiful i like that about how the royal tournament is going the protagonist's goal is to get closer to Luis, okay who also has the ability to become king himself because of the royal magic so he has a royal magic okay let's see what our current standing is Five thousand and twenty-one. From being in the public, we have to raise our popularity. This ranking changes through story this development. Is gas. This is gas. This is gas. This is fire. As you can see, the player has a lot of options on how they want to spend each day of their journey. Okay. You can use the online feature, Traveler's Voices, to see how other. Okay, so. Okay, this this is this is making a comeback. This is also from Persona Three, but. I mean, this is a way to wait. Whoa, 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 what are what are these like? What are these like? It's split into. Well, I guess it all adds up to one hundred percent, but it was like split up into sections. But I guess like these are the four most like popular uh, combinations of the things that they did. That day. You can also. I'm broke. I'm gonna have money after this game. October is gonna cook me, bro. I have Sparking Zero to get. I have this to get. I have Sonic X Shadow Generations to get. It's too much, man. It's too much. Of other players who and I'm broke right now. Your so my whole paycheck is going Each player will have their into this. Day -to -day way of like, progressing next to this. I gotta pay rent. The story, oh, man. Which is one of the true charms Metaphor offers. Let's move on and see how it's like to travel on a gauntlet. Yeah, show runner. me the gauntlet runner. This reminds me of like, um, Gurren, Log Gurren Logon. Traveling on this shit. Ain't this releasing the same day as Sparking Zero? It is releasing the same day as Sparking Zero, but Sparking Zero comes out uh, three and a half days before, not three and a half, three and a fourth days before this because of early access. So I'm gonna have three and one fourth days to play Sparking Zero, and then this comes out, and I'm gonna just be playing both at the same time. Map. Your allies will give <coughs> advice on destinations and tell you what the schedule will be. Okay. We have two requests to do in Comero, so let's head there. Hey. It's dangerous outside of town, so traveling is done by Gauntlet Runner. Okay. While on is the road, this like you can do things you might do in real life when on a camper van? Okay. Such as reading or cooking. So you can do s how you perform Wait. when on a camper van. Such as while on the road, you can do things you might do in real. I want to see what that thing is. No, wrong way. Wait, no, I was going the right way. What is what is this section? We could see all the other sections, but we couldn't see the other one because the. The black part was like in the way. What is it? I knew it. It is eloquence. Oh, I'm nice. I'm Such so nice. Reading or cooking. How you perform I'm so in nice. battle can vary greatly. Gotta say for college, man, they can't be doing this with me. Depending I'm trying to go back to college. To prepare so. yourself while en route <clears throat> somewhere. Protagonist max HP. Your allies okay. have their own things they do while on the Gauntlet Runner. What do they do? Let's try talking to Stroll to see what he's up to. Hey. Yeah, talk to him. Sometimes he it's best to clear one of hone our him. weapons. Okay, so it he makes like weapons. Maintaining your weapon hones your courage. Increases your courage, okay. By improving your what do you use like these social stats for? Okay, here we go. Of the protagonist changes. 
Oh, okay, it unlocks more options. Yeah. It's particularly indispensable for gaining cooperation from your okay. followers. Okay. So we should do what we can to raise these virtues. That makes sense. Players are free to choose how they spend their time while on the Gauntlet Runner. You can she reminds me of Haru and Chihaya. Like, just design-wise. Special items in the kitchen, or even do laundry with your allies. Hey, okay. Looks like we found an item. Got the little laundry. bunny rabbit. Someone must you have can, been hiding it. You can find like you stuff. Time in town. Players can <clears> choose clothes? what to do and enjoy their journey at a smooth pace. You can also stop by a nearby village if there is one. Okay, we but what do we something. do at the village? Let's go. Oh, you just got something. Ally right away. I knew it. This thing's the There's a lot of party members, which is good. We finished our request from Muras, the gauntlet. Okay, so this is kind of like social links, but instead of being social links, it's requests. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight ranks. Runner engineer. Thanks to that, we awaken. Oh wait, no, I'm bugging. This is what this is what they meant by ranks. There's twenty of them, isn't there? There's twenty of them. When we checked the party earlier, they had the ranks. The gunner archetype. Okay, that's for the archetypes. Oh, like there's a skill an tree. Factor for deepening your bonds with your followers. Let's go okay, the there's so much. There's so much right now. Get for them. They're also or selling those... bath salts that you can't find in town. Okay, you does it tell you when you can? Items like this on your travels, so you should try visiting cool. as many places as you can. Got to stack up on the money too. Quest dungeons. Okay. It looks like the Is this the main stuff? Arrived to the labyrinth called Man Eater's, Man -Eater's Grotto. Grotto. Let's try what channeling do? that gunner archetype we just got. What does it do? The gunner can attack quickly from afar. In okay. Battle, so it's relatively easy to get an advantage and move to a squad battle. So that's kind of like shooting in, in uh, Persona 5. Real time action. Like that, that one Joker ability where you can like shoot from far to start the, the battle. In squad battle, the gunner shoots ranged physical attacks and also maintains its attack power from the back. Wait, I just realized. Okay, this is how you... Is this like switching personas? Is that what it is? One of the benefits of improving your bonds with your followers is that you can obtain new archetypes, oh. which gives you more strategies to use in battle in addition to unlocking all kinds or of Or is it just them that can use it? You can use in battle. So much. By the way, you can always return to your base town from the dungeon in an instant. That's so beautiful. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. I like retreat. that. I like that. If you can't complete a dungeon within a day, you can set up camp in front of the dungeon and go back to tackling it okay. the next day. Okay, that's cool too. However, don't get too distracted on tackling dungeons Why not? that you forget the time limit for your main oh, mission. Oh, okay. Is this right? right, these are side quest dungeons, basically. What we just looked at were dungeons for the mini side quests we okay. have in store for you. What about the main let's stuff? Let's take a look at another kind of dungeon as well. Oh no, there's another dungeon. Here's a first. Oh, there's main quest. Okay. Main quest dungeon. This it's shit looks crazy. A worm, believe it or not. It's a dungeon. There's enemies in a worm. Since you time limit. Before you get digested and. <laughs> <laughs> That's fire. That's gas. Also, I just realized my mic is ass right now. Is it? Oh, no, 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 it's not, no, it's not, no, it's not, no, it's not. It's good. I think it's better now, though. Hold on. Time limit before you get digested? That makes sense, and it's cool. It there are a lot of creative fantasy dungeons. Okay, I, hold on. I like that transition. It's a battle. Metaphor. The timer's still going when you're in battle too. It's we on the top right. I see it. A lot it. of dungeons. A lot of dungeons. Small. Big and small. And we hope you look forward to them. Okay. See, I like that. That there's like varying like time differences in dungeons, bro. I don't want all the dungeons to follow the same structure, like they did in prior games. Well, I mean, there was only one game that I well, two games. Uh, Persona Four, Persona Five. Like, sure, in Persona Four, there were like gimmicks in the dungeons, but like you know, you just keep going to the top or that one Naoto dungeon where you go to the bottom. And you, you fight the boss, and there's like many bosses in between. Or Persona Five, you just go through palaces, and you know there's different puzzles, I guess. But you know you just reach a checkpoint, and you you steal the heart 
I mean, steal the, tre I mean, plant the path to the treasure, steal the heart. You know, it's a little repetitive. So I hope that there's more variety in these dungeons. Now then, let's continue on. And don't even get me started on Tartarus and fucking mementos. Here's a first look at the town Port, Port Brian Brian Haven. City of Water. This looks Brian beautiful. Haven. It's what happens if you fall off that water cliff? Sailors come and go. <clears throat> first, let's head towards the port itself. Uh huh. You can see a lot of street stalls lined up. For what? Let's take a look at the armor shop. Mm, I ain't no Thanks sailors need armor. My followers' abilities. I can get a discount here. Oh. And after talking to so you really gotta like spread your influence like for real, for real. Soon. Here's the port area. Uh huh. There's some strange balls of water. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. There are a lot Why? of they look like planets throughout the area of Brylehaven. There's also a coliseum further inside. For the fighting? City. Can I fight in the can coliseum? How many things are in store for you to do? Please tell me I can fight. Let's keep walking. I want to have like mini tournaments. Where the tavern is. Tavern. There are a lot of inns too. Businesses booming from people coming in for the royal tournament for the throne. Mm -hmm. Here is a seafood restaurant, which you might expect. You fish in town. the seafood restaurant? That's kind of cool. Course, since we're in a new town, there's new activities for us to experience. New activities. If you wanted to take in the sights to hone your virtues, you can take a boat tour around town okay. or see the special view from a view cool. spot up high. Oh, yeah? The more you progress through the story, the more there is for you to do. If you're unsure about what there is to do... You That's what I was going to say, because I was going to say, like, there's so much to do. How am I supposed to know, like, what I'm supposed to do? Press the Galica button to I ask, like ask your companion for advice. <laughs> I like that. She'll always help show you around, like a concierge for your travels. Concierge. Ooh, I like the way you pronounce that. Travel routines. Your travel map will slowly get more and more complex. Uh-huh. As you can see on this screen, there are multiple routes you can take to get to the same location. Okay, I like that. It's giving you options. That's pretty gas. If you visit multiple places in one stretch, the number of days you use will decrease proportionally. Uh -huh. But you may end up needing to tackle battle after battle, so you'll need the power to match. Right. Planning your travel route is another area of the game where so you So it's based on like your situation your at that time. That's cool. Despite how tough gauntlet runners are, it's still dangerous to go around it. Yeah, I heard somebody shit their pants while playing this game. So at night, like in a good way. They pause their travels and rest up at a campsite. Here you can take okay. your pick of nighttime activities, such as having a relaxed conversation with your allies nice, nice. or taking a bath. Oh, I can take a bath? Let's try taking a soak in the cask tub at the back of the deck. Yeah, what's that what's that tub looking like? Oh, it's there. While we're at it, let's use the bath salt that we bought oh, at one of the villages. Oh, right, before. they did buy a bath salt. It has that a looks, relaxing effect. That looks comforting. Which increased the protagonist's stats. By the way, there are different kinds of bath salts available, which okay. you can find as you travel throughout the land. That makes sense. Looks like we came across something. Another pa pleasure of traveling is coming falls? across scenic sites you'd only see in another world. <clears throat> okay, but do they do anything for you? A commemoration sketch. If you give it to one of your followers, a young girl who's awaiting your return in Grand Trap. Okay, will so you do have something. The Uncharted Isle, Virga Island. Here's another I love their blue hair characters. A place called Virga Island. So All far, this game is heat. You can enjoy unique tracks themed after religious music composed by Shoji Meguro, who is well known yeah. for on the Persona series. Talk. Here, the protagonist makes yet another new encounter. Is that a new follower? Her name is Yufa, a new ally that's only now being revealed in this oh. showcase. Oh. must be the... I wonder what role she Priestess. plays in the protagonist's journey. Me too. I hope you look forward to learning more about her in the future. Wait, that's all you're gonna show? What do you mean review? If it's just going over everything? If you had to actually go on a long journey in real life, it wouldn't be a simple endeavor. Mm, uh-huh. Taking that into account, we hope that you enjoy the journey of metaphor, where you can travel as you please from the comfort of your own home. Though we've largely focused on the profound fantasy elements of metaphor, simply it is wait, whoa, special demo. More details related to there'll be another special demo available at the event, bitch. I don't care. I'm not at the event. Uh, what did I press? What did I press? Uh, I pressed play on TV. Okay, hold up. Damn, there's mad fucking. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I I saw what I needed to see. Like I'm already sold. 
I don't want to see too much because I don't want to get because this is a story based game, so I don't want to get spoiled on story and shit. I already know the premise of the game now. I'm good. I don't want to see anything story wise. Is this a popularity rank screen? Oh yes. So that poster shit. It wasn't no promotional campaign. That's actually in the game. You gotta raise your popularity. Yeah. I want to protect this country and its people. Try to be on fantasy. If you get rid of the culprit, I will appeal to the people of this town to support you. Okay. Knight's proclamation. More public gab, gab. Yo, he's inner. Yo, that's his inner Yoshida. Yo, that's Yoshida from Persona Five, or not? Or Namatame from Persona Four, man. Support, yeah, the rally the people. Wait, what do you mean? Put your face. Bigger face on the rock. What do you mean bigger face on the rock? What is the? There's some significance with the rock. I've seen that multiple places, and I think I saw an ice sculpture of it in the last trailer. That is a crazy looking demon. <clears throat> oh, is that the worm? Oh, I did not need to see that. Oh, I did not need to see that. Can you smell it? There's change in the air. All screen animation is not actual game footage. Why are you showing me this? And Count Luis hopped on his trail. You dreamt of utopia. You saw the tribes united as one. Mm -hmm. Are you riding a sword? What? Who do you know doing that shit, bro? Who do you know? Nobody. Ain't nobody doing it like him. How are you going to respond to them? Wait, was that the protagonist talking? Shit. We get to fight the other participants? That's really what I want. I want to prove my worth. Okay, I'm solo in this game. I'm solo in this game. Hold up. Is there anything I really need to see? Gauntlet Runner already saw that. Creator interview. I, I, respectfully, I don't really care. The Royal Tournament. Creator's voice. Atlas exclusive showcase. Okay, hold up. King's Trial? Let me see this. Let me see this. Let me see this. Is there anything I need to see from these trailers, bro? Because I'm not trying to get spoiled on, like, story stuff, man. I I, I'm already sold. Believed. Mix of gameplay and non-gameplay footage? That I might end the strife and discrimination. <clears throat> By non-gameplay, do y'all mean, like, cutscenes? Because if that's the case, then that's fine. It's technically still gameplay, I guess. Let us speak of the old vulture's last grasp at power. The tournament for the throne. Yeah. So, summing up, our first trial is to slay a monster. Sounds like we've lost a few candidates already. Riding a sword is crazy. Poor bastards went after something too nasty for them. I gotta work on my oxen. I gotta work on that before humans. before this game comes out. Running or going mad. What do we believe in, really? On the middle, in the middle of the thing, of the Gorn lock, of the logo. Xenoblade ass accent. I can't take it anymore. Hey man, don't let Zelda hear you saying that. You're in this race to become king. Yes. Not exactly. Wait, not exactly. All oh, right, he wants to like the. There's a curse or some shit. All right. Each ally of a different tribe. Yo, the UI is so creative. I remember seeing that from the from the Game Awards trailer. Fear and anxiety. They always lead the people astray. Right. This place, it isn't a utopia. What is it then? If that's the real world. Then it can die alongside you. Whoa! I will not let you die in vain. The fuck was that? I don't even know what I just saw. Did I say unscathed triumph? 
Is that what sh what pops up when you like perfect? Like you don't get touched? To the gallows, not just us, but any innocent folks he doesn't find useful. It is a new dawn, and its light shines upon Lord Luis's king. That sounds Irish. That's clean. The racist outcome is beyond your mentally. So his archetype thing rides the sword too. The He's the seeker, right? Dream will do me no good. Did she die? This, See, that's this what I'm talking about. Why are you spoiling that for me? Okay, they're going to show something after the trailer. What are they showing? What is this? Okay. This feels like the beginning. This feels like early game theme. Or like the end of the very, very end of the game, like after the villains defeated and we know we're happy. Alright. Listen. I don't think I, I don't feel like I should watch any of the trailers. I don't want to get spoiled on anything else. I'm good. That that's all I needed to see. <laughs> like I'm sold. I'm sold. I'm sold on this shit, bro. I need this. This shit is gas, man. Oh my god.